Well, we're not going to have any closings through the nighttime tonight. It's going to be a very pretty night uh, as far as the temperature goes anyway. Very comfortable overnight low tonight dropping down into the upper 40s under a mostly cloudy sky, but the clouds are not producing any precipitation just yet. Within the next 24 hours, however, I do believe that's going to change. 52 in Terre Haute, 52 in Linton. Robinson has 54, Casey 52, Mattoon 52. Everybody has temperatures in the 40s. Bloomington 55 degrees. And so the wind is now from the south in Paris at 17 miles per hour. In Terre Haute, 9 miles per hour. Just a little bit of a southeast wind in Robinson at 8. Vincennes 6 and only 9. So everybody has a nice south breeze going on there. And I mentioned this earlier. Anything that wasn't melted as far as snow and ice uh, will be, it'll help to be evaporated by some of this wind that's blowing around. Now it's somewhat breezy tonight, so it's not real, real likely, but still a little bit of light fog is not out of the question. So you may want to keep that in mind, especially in some low lying areas where there's especially still some snow on the, on the ground. Casey had a 26 mile per hour gust. That's pretty good gust. Uh, Paris 25, Rockville 21, Linton 33 miles per hour as far as a wind gust. Uh, and now we look for some colder temperatures because that's that's what we look for when we you know, because the, the thing about weather is you can you can take a look at all the maps and everything like that. But the very simple thing about weather is that weather moves. And so if you can figure out where the weather is in one place and what direction it's moving, then you can figure out what it's going to be in that other place. And so it's cold, for example, in Bismarck and Billings. And this cold air is moving in our direction. So we can tell you that it's going to get colder here. I don't think it's going to drop into the single digits because the actual atmosphere will modify a little bit, but it does look like it's going to get colder as a cold front comes in probably tomorrow afternoon or evening. Here's a look at the storm team future cast. This is through the first part of the day. Tomorrow we're OK, but here's the afternoon Saturday evening at 6 p.m. Looks like rain back in the picture. In some cases, some heavy rain. And so then here comes this colder air right here. So you can see by Sunday at 6 a.m. the colder air will have moved in. And so that means that it's goodbye to the temperatures in the 50s and so on. And we're going to be back to more January like conditions. 48, partly cloudy, breezy and cool tonight. 58, some afternoon rain developing tomorrow. And then for tomorrow night, 33, windy and cold. If you're out later tomorrow night, oh boy, I'll tell you. Uh, wintry mix is possible. North breeze to 16, gusting at times to 21. And the seven day forecast, Sunday 33, Monday 31. We may have a lingering flurry or two in the first part of the day on Monday, but other than that, that's about it. Daytime highs will probably stay in the low to mid 30s, which actually now is a little bit below normal for this time of year. So.